Good day everyone, welcome to Senior Pablo TV. And for today's tutorial video, we will be discussing the dimensional analysis under our measurement. We have here the common SI units and the English system conversions. So in order for us to understand this dimensional analysis, we need to familiarize the different conversions in our SI and English system conversion. So we have for the length or distance, so we have one inch is equal to 2.54 centimeters. One foot is equal to 12 inches. One yard is equal to three feet. One mile is equal to 5,280 feet. One mile is equal to 1,760 yards. One mile is equal to 1.61 kilometers, and so on. We have also for the area and for the mass or the weight and for the volume or capacity. So at least memorize some of our conversion or at least familiarize these conversions to help you to easily answer the questions in our module or in the given problems. So let, let us try to apply this conversion and how it works in our dimensional analysis. So in our dimensional analysis, we need to follow this one. So we have the given unit, the given in your problem, times the desired unit over the given unit is equal to the desired unit. So notice, if you're going to divide the given unit, divided by the given unit, okay, this will be canceled out. That's why we will come out with the desired unit. And now let us try by answering the question number one. What is the length in centimeters of a stick that is 8.50 inches long? So we have a given unit, our given unit is 8.50 or 8.5 inches times, so we're now going to look in our conversion, conversion table, we're going to find centimeters. So in our conversion, we know that one inch is equal to 2.54 centimeters. So the given unit, one inch, and desired unit is cm. So we need to write 2.54 cm. Okay. Inches will be canceled out. And now we're going to multiply. So we can use our calculator. So 8.5 times 2.54. That will give us 2.54. In fraction, it is 200, uh, 2,100. So 8.5 times 2.54, it should be in decimals. So if you want to find the function going to decimal, just press SD. It will give you the decimal equivalent, that is 21.59. This is our unit, CM. Okay. Again, let us repeat. The given is 8.50 inches. We're going to multiply to the desired unit, which is the cm. In our conversion, one inch is equal to 2.54 cm, all over one inches or one inch. So cancel, then just multiply. Now let us try number two. What is the length in inches of a rod that is eight meters long? So the given is 
8 meters times we're going to convert into inches but in our conversion we only have cm to inches so first we need to convert the 8 meters to cm so in cm we know that 1 meter is equal to 100 cm okay times one again let us repeat 100 cm all over 1 meter now meter will be cancelled out cm to inches now we have inches to cm so the desired unit is inches inch and in our conversion that is 2.54 cm so cm will be cancelled out now 8 times 100 8 times 100 equals divided by 2.54 divided by 2.54 that is 314.96. 314.96, our unit is inches. So, that is the dimensional analysis. Now, let's have some more exercises. And now, let's try our problem number three. How many cups are there in a gallon of water? So, the given unit is gallon, one gallon. Our desired unit is cups. So that is under our volume. So notice in our conversion, we have the equivalent for one gallon and
Now, we have kilometer going to meter. We know that 1 kilometer is equal to 1,000 meters. So we can cancel now kilometer and kilometer. We're done in the meter. Now we're going to convert hours to seconds. So times 1 hour would be on top in our numerator so it will be cancelled out one hour the equivalent of one hour to seconds is 3600 seconds so hours will be cancelled out the remaining unit will be meter over seconds now let us multiply 20 times 1.61 times 1000 equals we need to divide by 3,600. So that is 8.9 meters per second. So this will be our final answer. 8.9 meter per second. That is the dimensional analysis and how to use our common SI unit and the English system conversion. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo 